Hello guys. Okay, so I'm back with another video of Linux Tool Changer. Uh, I've set up four tool head at the moment, and now I'm doing the homing. Uh, the reason why the bit drops so much is because I have the servo uh, right in front. The whole dock position has been moved slightly in front. Actually, I want to. The reason I move it because I have the uh, triple Z with the rail in the middle. So, so that uh, why I move it in front so that I can put one dock in the middle so that it doesn't hit the triple Z. But it seems that uh, it still hit this center part. If you can see here, center part of the arm when the bed moves totally up, still hit the bottom of the dock. So I might have to change either the dock uh, design a bit or see how I can play around with the space. But right now I have four tool head. So because of that, because of the dock position has been moved in front, the probe for the servo has also moved in front to avoid the the tools on the dock. So the uh, one thing is VisiBot has a very big bit because it's is uh, designed to maximize as much as you can print, and the the spacing is not much at the back. So the servo tends to the servo arm when deploy it will hit the bed so i have to drop the bed uh, when deploying the probe and also when picking up the probe okay so now i have four tool heads currently just to show you a random tool change of the four tool head uh, they will do a tool change but randomize uh, to show how it works everything and let's do a, maybe a 20 randomization, 20 iteration, 15 iteration, right? Let's do it. So this is the uh, randomized tool change of the tool head. So uh, the BTC people done by Jack Beam is actually uh, okay already. I mean, they he released his alpha version but we are still working on more right now as you can see the led status i don't have the led status fixed yet on the tool head these are the nozzle leds but just to test the led status as well you can see that when he the light turns green when the tool is going to be active and once the tool is docked the light turns yellow so to show the led status uh, I'll do another 15 iterations of tool change to let you see again. Right? So these are randomized. They he pick up the tool in random order. It's not like one, two, three, four. He randomized the tool picking up. Just like in real life scenario. So after this we're going to do all the basic uh, PID, the basic uh, calibration and also the nudge. For the offsets and from there we will print uh, our first model with uh, four tool heads right uh, if you like to try this out you can join us in our discord channel all right see you guys